Okay. Dishonored 2. I'll put that right there. That looks like a good place for it. Great. The off switch says, Hey, Rich. Hey, Rich. Have you thought about playing Final Fantasy Tactics? It combines all your favorite gameplay elements from RTS and <laughs> Final Fantasy. If you haven't, then I'm invalidated as a person or something. <laughs> uh, Rich, I'll tap me uh, back over to OBS real quick, please. Thank you. No problem. Thank you, Rich. I'll be right back. Rich will be back. I'm gonna get dishonored on the screen. Boom. There's dishonored. Great. Boom. Loading up. What is your favorite stealth game for Rich? That means outside the Thief games. Very important question. Uh, outside the Thief games. Uh, you know, and like, and for, for me, I haven't played much, but uh, Mark of the Ninja is a beautiful stealth game. More and more, that's more in my line of stealth, where it's more actiony, arcadey. Mark of the Ninja is beautiful. Uh, I, I, while I did enjoy, uh, I think we played it on stream. That sir, you are being hunted. That was more survival than stealth, but marketed ninja mark of the ninja is a 2d uh action stealth game where you play as a ninja mark of the ninja it's great really great game uh, made by clay same people who did uh invisible ink and uh they've done a bunch of good stuff Jack, who is your own personal Jesus? Someone to hear your prayers. Someone who cares. Your own personal Jesus. All right, we got to change some options here. Hold on. Change some control options right away. Set up. I know for sure. Yeah, look at the sensitivity way down there. We gotta turn that sensitivity way up. I go to keyboard map in here. Jump is space. Stealth mode. I like R. Oh no, stealth mode. I like for sprints. I like R. Uh, left. Lean right. Oh yeah. Okay. I got that. I'm using my. I'm using my chuck. My, my one-handed chuck and my gaming mouse from home, so it has the same setup. Uh, weapons is mouse five. Block is left alt. Spyglass is V. Wheel hold mouse three, yep, short. Great, all right, great, I think that's everything. Oh wait, one more thing I need to do. Change it as we get is uh visuals we need to look at uh, defaults at 80 which i think is crazy we're gonna bump that up to like 95 is where i think i had it at home that was a good field of view and great and great disable oh it was mouse smoothing on maybe that's what i was having i was having some slight issues at home ah Mouse smoothing was on. Yep, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Great, thank you. That Maybe that's why I was having a problem at home. I'll have to double check that when I play this back at home. All right. Great, and we will go right into the campaign because I know how to play. Make a new game. Going to play it on medium. Because, you know, hard is for people who are veterans of Dishonored, and I've never played a Dishonored game. No, 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 I've already done the tutorial, that's fine. Great. Sent you guys an email linking to a really cool video of the very rare teaser trailer of Giant Carpenter's thing. Oh, cool, great, thanks, Epic Jason.
Why is even motion blur and smoothing by a default anymore? Can, de can developers not let that die? Maybe not. I don't know. I don't know. That's just how they feel. This is something weird. In the menu, look how janky my mouse is in the menu. It's the same at, at home. The, the gameplay is fine, like, but do you see how the mouse is like stuttering all over the place? I have no idea why that is in it, but it's just in this screen. The mouse stutters. In the actual game, it's fine, but. Oh, you know what? I don't have uh, subtitles on, I'm very sorry. This is uh, recapping Dishonored 1. Uh, your mom died. That's what that's what happened in Dishonored 1. Your mom died. And now you're the queen. We're going to skip all this. We're going to skip all this. Uh, Rich, can you hit the escape button for me? Thank you. Options. Probably audio. Subtitles. We'll turn subtitles on because I know you guys like that main dialogue. Uh, just main dialogue. Back. Yes. Back. Resume. Okay, there we go. Now we're ready to go. Oh my god. Game audio is a quiet hissing. I'm not looking forward to all the ceremony The game audio isn't being played through the stream. Oh good. Uh, I ride bicycles often. Well, it's up and to you if you escape. want to try and fix it, Jack. Uh, I mean, we should, right? We. Oh, I skipped an important cutscene. Whoopsie. Whoopsie doops. Hold on. All right. Uh, can you uh, alt tab? All right. There you go. Thank you. Let's look at the. Uh, that should be fine. I don't know what's up with that. Um. And then hit escape for me. Please. Escape? Yeah. I did. Oh, I guess I need to. Okay, so I, I, I actually skipped a really important cutscene here. Do you want to just start, quit, and redo it so they can see the cutscene? Yeah. Yeah, just quit out of it. You should probably see that. I didn't know I'd skip that cutscene. I've I, I forgot. You're gonna have to close the game unless you start the game and get to a menu and close it sure. properly. Close window. Great. Game audio game says a dumb thing. A dumb thing in Mass Effect Three was that the Asari knew what was going to happen for millennia, but decided to be a society of boring prostitutes that told nobody. I guess they succeeded in fucking everyone. Yeah, Mass Effect Three is dumb. Uh, what, do you want? what do you want? It's dumb. Ah, uh, that's great. They succeeded in fucking everyone. That's a good joke. Is it really that important? Yeah. What do I think of the lottery? I think it's dumb. I think the lottery is dumb. It's the dumb tax. It's the dumb tax, yes. It's... The, the dumber you are, actually, the more you get taxed. It's... It, the lottery is the worst. Um, uh, if you're reasonable about it, it's fine. You spend, a, what, a buck a week? There, there's just... There's infinitely better ways to spend that money. Sure there are. All right. You spend a buck, and if you're not desperate for money where that buck will go a long way, eh, you get to fantasize about winning the lottery for a week. It's fine. All right. What I'm hoping is if I take the master volume and just turn it down, maybe that'll work? I don't know. How's the game audio now? Is, is the game audio still a weird hissing? What about a raffle for charity? What? Well, that's different. A raffle for charity is absolutely different. Then you know how's that. How's it different? How's it? How's it significantly different? Okay, so like you know, like, let's say you go to the local soup kitchen. Yeah. And uh, and a business donated a, a, a DVD copy of the th a Blu-ray copy of the thing, right? Hold on. Wait. First of all, uh, audio. Still very low. It's barely, barely audible. audible. But before up in OBS. wait, but before it was a hit, it was a hissing. 
turn it up in OBS and see what happens. You okay. want to alt tab you? Yeah, alt tab me. I don't hear any hissing. Yeah, we got we got reports of hissing before. Okay. Turn up more on that. You can turn down in game. Is it too late? Now it should be fine. Now you should hear the audio when we're not talking. I can turn it up in game still. Hold on. Okay. No hiss. Before the game. Okay. Okay, I hear game. Okay, great. I've turned it up a bit. Now you should be hearing anything. Okay, so... So, if if a, if a local soup kitchen is raffling off a, a copy of John Carpenter's The Thing, mm -hmm. everyone puts in $5, uh, you know, one person gets John Carpenter's The Thing, all that money goes to the soup kitchen. That money goes to help people. Okay. It goes to help a specific thing, right? Mm -hmm. The lotter lottery earnings go towards the city, mm -hmm. right? And, you know, that's, that gets spent on general city type things, but you have no control in, over the, where that money goes. I believe in theory, at least this is Illinois, back a while ago, yeah. went to education specifically. And uh, I think that's a difference. Uh, st that's a state-by-state -state difference. Okay. But there, there's, no, there's no way of knowing where that money's going, and... I would hate for the Illinois Education Department to be dependent on idiots giving money to the lottery for my for my earnings. Okay. It's fairly dependable. <laughs> Apparently. It's fairly dependable, Jack. Apparently. It's a tutorial. No. I think most lotteries go to education. I, d I wouldn't want an education system that's depend that's dependent on idiots giving money. Octoj, I've seen you ask that question before. I don't think we're going to talk about what kind of phone Rich has. That strikes me as as vaguely weird. Yeah, because yeah, it was having issues on the show. I think. Oh, okay, maybe. If, if given the choice to upgrade, what would I switch to? Yeah. I don't give a fuck about phones. I just want something that I can send text on. Yeah. And and hang up without it being a problem. Like it was on the show. That was an issue. That phone has been replaced. Oh, okay. Other than that, I whatever. Oh, it's got hyper net stream I, the phone. I'm going to... It needs to have the hyper net I'm gonna stream. I'm going to do the internet on my home desktop computer. I don't need this shit... And, and I need to look up something every now and then. It doesn't need to be fancy. I had forgotten about the the bit on the show with your phone, and so yeah. like to me that was like that was like a digging at a personal information question. Yeah. So I was like, yeah. eh. so that's why that's why I never, um, but, that's why I never answered that before. Yeah, I'm just not overly concerned with having a fancy phone. What what's your dream phone? I don't know one that works. Are you are you interested at all in a phablet? What's that? It's one of those giant phones. No, that sounds horrible. Yeah, they, they look really weird. But it's got a big screen on it. Yeah. I'm not looking forward to all this ceremony today. So what you uh, what people might have missed in the, that little backstory is uh, so our mother got killed in Dishonored One, and our dad, who is now our head of security, uh, got vengeance for her. Mm-hmm. And now there is a new killer on the loose, the Crown Killer, who happens to be killing enemies of the Crown, us, the Princess yeah. Queen. And so they're framing us for all of these killings. Okay. That, that's the story. I'm not going to screw up and k skip the cutscene again, even though I desperately want to. Mostly because I've seen it before, you know, because I played this part, and so it's just like, I'm itching. I'm itching. Corvo is dad, yes. We are Corvo's daughter. Corvo is Garrett. No, no. Someone's trying to make us look guilty by targeting your enemies. I wish I could just run away from all this. Sometimes you do. You think I don't know about your nights out on the rooftops? Courage. The ceremony will be over soon. And is that Garrett's voice actor? Yeah. Oh, okay. 
Wait, is Corvo not? Corvo's definitely your dad. Played a little bit of Dishonored 1. Unless there was a plot twist, you weren't. He was, oh, very, really? he was very much in love with the queen, was the implication, but yeah. he was just like the the bodyguard. Oh, I guess, you know what? Maybe I wasn't paying too much attention to the story. I just assumed he was my dad. He's, he, he, basically, he father, you know, but oh, he okay. wasn't, I, don't, I don't think he was supposed to be the biological father. He wasn't royalty. Yeah, I think she just called him father. She might think of him that way. Sure. Look at these robots. That's cool. There's just a heavy implication. He's the dead figure. Okay, all right. Jessamine. Ooh, Jessamine. So you're an anti-story guy. How do you feel about this? My first watch through, I was okay. Like, this is extra tough because I've already seen this all before. But I mean, apparently, I did, it didn't even all sink in. But I, I do enjoy this world. I enjoy the look of the world, and so I'm, I find it easier to get into this because I am just curious about exploring this weird world of robots and magic so i like how it, and i like how it all looks thief <laughs> oh, i know thief yeah 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 living in my palace has protected you but that's all forever hear me all of you your rightful empress has returned all hail the empress delight first of her name arrest emily Baldwin and her father for the crown killer murder See, well, and and this is also fairly short yeah. bit of story, right? Which is very nice. See, she just said father again. This is all I'm saying. I, she says she said father. I didn't play all of the first game. I just played a little bit because at the time my computer was a piece of shit. Right. So here's what I did like about the story here. Because, so, like, this is where you get to choose who you want to be, right? Mm -hmm. And so, like, for me... Jack, we all know you secretly want to be a woman. I, I like playing as the woman. Um, but for me, the story in my head is I want vengeance over... Because I'm the, the princess queen, you know? This is my court to rule. Mm -hmm. And these motherfuckers are trying to take over my crown, so I want blood. And so I chose to be Emily so I could kill all of these assholes. Right. Uh, I am going to play as Corvo this time, just to see what's different. Okay. But, uh, usually. The Master 2000, nobody has ever said anything more factually incorrect in their entire life, even though it's not a fact, it's an opinion. What? Uh, that the, the, they're saying that the, the, the villain in Thief 2 was stupid. Oh! No, he was great, because he was so not a s typical villain. He talked like Droopy Dog. He talked like a lisp, and he, he was very... With you know, creepy. But oh, not not necessarily threatening. Sure. Oh, interesting. I want to be the princess queen. Yes. Oh, okay. My father lost it all. Sentenced the city watch one step of begging. Think I gotta take some orders. Or for a town, son of the Zirconian tradesman. Oh, they're saying the master doesn't like his voice acting. That's, that's what made it work. That's what. I heard shouting. Lord Corvo, what happened? I'll be all kept at Mayhew. Oh, that's the royal protector's fancy weapon. What kind of sword? 
Yes, word to your mother. That's because Stephen Russell was actually a really good voice actor. Mm -hmm. He did the voice of Garrett and the voice of Karis, who was the villain in Thief 2. Oh. Both sounded extremely different. Oh, that's very nice. Yeah. I like that. I have not. I, I'm not a fast swimmer, no. I'm an adequate swimmer. I stay afloat. All right. I'm going to continue my murder rampage now. Emily. Oh, God. I can do alone. I need to get out of here. All right. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Spin the globe. Just spin it. to lick my wounds. Got to All right, there's tons of... Oh, there's an apple here I can eat. All right, uh, I remember how to do this. Yunk. Yunk and cold. always has a way of turning sour. Just as soon as you get comfortable. Oh, peak. Nope. Delilah took away the mark of the outsider. No more sorcery. Lord Protector. I can't believe Rams. Oh. Is Lady Emily all right? That's a true underway. Emily is... she's imprisoned, for lack of a better word. You've got to get out of the tower. Maybe through Emily's safe. Um... I guess it's not too much of a spoiler. Uh, but... So I played as Emily the first time through. Yeah. And Corvo got trapped in marble. Yeah. And the exact same things have happened. Okay. So, it's just whoever you want to play as. Okay. So far... And obviously, this is... Like, nothing has happened yet. But so far... Nothing different has happened. Are all my buttons the same block? Okay. I brought my mouse from home specifically because I have all... Oh, because like, you're used to it. Like, I'm, I'm used to it and... Uh, got my little lean buttons here. Like, wait a minute. Oop. Oop. Came back. These bastards are working with Ramsey and the Duke of Sirkonos. Those bastards. And murder, murder, murder. We're gonna murder that guy with his back to us. It's my favorite Thief 2 level. Well, Life of the Party is impressive just for its sheer fucking size, but uh, I, forget the, I forget the name of the level. The one where you have to uh, sneak into Truart's home. It's pretty good. It's a nice twist in there. Murder, murder, murder. Come back here. I'm gonna murder you. I think he comes back. I don't, I don't know. I don't fucking know. I think there's only one guy down there. It's that guy. Oh, yeah, here he comes. Disloyal dogs, get out of town. Do 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 do. Put his body over here. Yoink. See, I'm not sure if Stephen Russell's sounding older because he's getting older, <laughs> or because he's just trying doing that for this character. Sure, just playing an older character. Yeah, right? yeah. Yay, murder. He holds the sword sideways when we're in stealth mode. And then if you're if you're kind of up, he, he holds it normally. But if you're in stealth mode, he kind of holds it sideways. 
I assume for stealthier kills? Well, it lets you what? know right away what mode you're in. Yeah. It serves its purpose. Mm-hmm. And see, I already know what's going to happen. He's going to he's gonna walk right past here, so I'm just going to kill him. Like I said, I've already played this level, so. Filthy murderer. I Oh, I know. Like, I'm, Rich is going to judge me because I'm... I'm I nah, you play the way you want, Jack. Like, for... It's not mine. It's not your... No, and you play, you play it how you want to play it. Uh, but, yeah, for me, my characters want revenge. They have been betrayed. And so there's no, there's no justice without murder. Do-do-do-do-do. Do 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 pickpocket and kill. Oh, I felt great. <laughs> kill, kill, kill. Do 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 do. There are non-lethal oh. methods. Jack does not give a shit. Yep, I know there's non-lethal methods. Jack does not give one single flying fuck. If you sneak up behind someone and press one button, you can, like, choke them out. Yeah. Uh, and if you press a different button, you kill them. Do they get up after a while or do they stay down? You wouldn't know. You murder everybody. I murder everybody, yeah. I don't know. These guys, I don't know who they are. I'm going to kill them. This guy, this guy over here. I, no wonder Jack likes clown. He he clearly has issues. Yeah. Yeah. I don't care. Looks very good. Ah, feels good. <laughs> Feels, I mean, look what these assholes murdered everyone at my daughter's party. All right, we gotta we gotta get moving now. We're gonna get moving. Run, 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 run. Murder, murder, murder. Whoa. And for those wondering, a lot of people ask our setup here. You know, I have I have my mouse on my on my lap desk here, and I'm using my my one-handed nunchuck. I gotta get one of those. For those, it's it's a you know what for the, it works in this game. It works for first-person games. Oh, it's in here. I don't think I went in here. Linens. Not where we want to go. We want to go into our secret safe room. I'm also not getting any of the gold. Need my ring to open the safe room. Ramsey has it. Like we already got it from Ramsey. Didn't we? Gosh darn it. Ramsey. Oh. Apparently I didn't. <coughs> Alright, now we got it. Man from Laurentum, yep. Chad is saying, Rich, yep. you said you would play any Final Fantasy game for $998. Yes. Would you be willing to play uh, the first hour of eight different games in the series for our schadenfreudic entertainment? Yeah, sure. If you were willing to pony up, $998. All right, I'll do that. You will play the first hour of the first eight Final Fantasy games. Sure. That seems dumb. It certainly doesn't seem like it's more likely to get me to to like Fantasy. Final Fantasy. I think they're they're just trying to think of getting their money's worth. Like what'll torture you the most? Hmm. And that might be it. That could be it because like that like that's the early stages of every game. That's the worst part of every game. Then you can never get deep into the endless grinding. <laughs> Get my gun. Hello. Out into the world once more. How many people had forgotten on this mask? Oh. Emily did not get the mask. By the by. Got my gun. So I think that's just his thing. Right. 
Just just pointing out differences. Emily, you know, we came here as Emily and got the gun too, but the mask wasn't waiting for us. Uh, what is this? Pistol bullets, just in case. Try not to use any of the pistol. And get the gold. The reserves won't help against Delilah, even if I had a way to carry it all out of here. I'll need this. Just, just chunks of gold laying on the on the on the glare. Look at this. Look at this art too. I like this right here. Mm -hmm. I don't know what it is, but I think it's cool looking. I think it's cool looking, basically. All right, let's get out of here. Let's go on with this with this nonsense. It's the mask he wore in the first game. I, I, oh, I assume. Oh, uh, yeah. Let's go to Down Street. I assume it's the mask he wore in the first game. Is there a mirror? I want to see our character with a mask. Yes. Agreed. Agreed, agreed. What awful torture to play really old JRPGs now. It, it is if you hate JRPGs. <laughs> Until I understand this, I have to go into hiding. I should make my way to the docks. Oh, take a picture. I don't know why we take the picture, but we take the picture. Jack, can you pick stuff up and examine it like a certain other game that shall not be mentioned? Uh, you, you cannot. Like, f uh, for example, there is uh, world building. Here's a book, and you can read it. Yeah, but you can't pick it up and... You cannot pick it up and look at it a lot like another game. Uh, but, you know, there's there's a lot of flavor text uh, in this. And then, like, you know, you can open up cabinets. A lot of times there'll be, like, gold or shit in here. Uh, I'm skipping through all that just because I've already done this at home. Oh, like, here, here's some gold pieces. Yoink, coin. Here's, like, a little toilet. You should put the seat down. Always put the seat down. Oh, actually, you know what? You know what's actually really neat? I don't know if they have anything like this in Thief. I'm, I'm sure they do. Mm. Uh, before you open a door. Keyhole. Look at the keyhole. That is neat. Hey, look at it. Anyone out there? Anyone out there? <laughs> Wait, do that again. Oh, sure. Hold on. Why is the whole door moving? The whole eye hole is moving with your eye. It doesn't look like... Eh, maybe it is. Maybe it isn't. It looks like it is a little bit. Well, the door would move a little bit if, like, if your whole face is. Well, it looked like a problem. It looked like it was static to me. Oh, okay. But no, I can see a little bit of movement. A little bit of movement. It's fine. Not as much as I don't. I think there should be, but it's a video game, so we're gonna let it. We're gonna let it slide. Yeah. Great. Hoi. You can fall from a moderate height. By the way. You know what? I didn't search up here before. Ooh. I went a completely different route last time. That's what I'm liking about the game so far. Is, uh... A lot of, lot of different ways to handle a situation. Thief. Huh? <coughs> Nothing. Nothing. He's got some good fucking ears. Yep. Oh, yeah, I didn't even go over here last time. Uh, it may, it's very, very possible that OBS does not like Dishonored 2. Yes. Uh, in an effort to ease up, I'm going I'm to keep going like this so we know exactly when it freezes again, by the way. Rich, so keep an eye on that. In an effort to uh, ease the stress of the, <coughs> of the computer in general, uh, I t the graphical settings were on high. I turned them down to low. Mm -hmm. I don't know if that will help. I doubt it. This is this is what I got. 
You are back for now. We are. I don't know if it will help. Dishonored. And. No, I'm still moving. So that's good. I'm still moving. And I'm going to hit resume. And well, no, if you're not moving in the game on the yeah. screen, Jack. I don't, I don't think you need to move your arms. You need, you need the arm movement. Okay, all right. Shit. God damn it. You know what? Come here. Fight me. Shoot him. You're doing great, Jack. I feel like I'm doing great. There we go. There's like a parry thing where I, if you can if you can hit him at just the right time. Right. Dick. Uh So, in any case, everything's fine. Everything's fine is now. Is it Is it? I don't I don't think it is. It's not. All right. Back to sneaking. Sneak, sneak, sneak. Can I go that way? Which, which way was it? Oh. Sneak, sneak, sneak. Sneaking through the city. Sneak, sneak, sneak. There's a bunch of rats here. I need to get above people. I don't I don't like being being down here. I like being above people. Ooh, except for maybe this guy. I bet I could kill this cunt. Doot, 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 doot. Anyone see that? Nope. Yep. Somebody saw that. Running away. You are fucked. Running away. Did he see me? Yep. yep. Ow. That was a great parry. I, I'm, I'm on it. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. For a thousand people here today. Oh my god, is that just since we started Dishonored 2? I, I'm, it's the, it's a brand new game. Yep. Um, people want to see Dishonored 2. People want to see Jack, uh, you know, fail at Dishonored 2. That's fine. They don't know what they want. Okay, back to it. How do I get up? I want to get up. Can I climb on you? I want to climb. Maybe we'll cl climb here. Playing this lethally is like playing Monopoly and ignoring the whole property ownership thing. Uh, you know, I can play any game how I goddamn want to. Bald rich? Yeah, no shit. No shit. What, what the fuck do you want me to do? Just grow hair magically? You prick. They caught me again. It's because you're trying to kill them rather than just like sneaking past them. I did. I actually tried to sneak past them yeah. that time and I failed horribly. Or is this just a combat tutorial thing? Eh, it could be. I don't know. Did they forget about me? Ah, dick. Too many of you. What? <laughs> Wait! <laughs> he just threw a rock at me! <laughs> that was great! That dickhead just picked up a rock! <laughs> I was great. ready for some kung fu bullshit and he picked up a rock and he <laughs> threw it at me! Gosh darn it. How does it how does it feel to be outwitted by game AI? Uh, apparently, uh, I mean it's good AI. <laughs> Gosh, wow. 
Wowzers. Maybe I'll try this side. How about that? How about we'll learn from Yes, you got Indiana Jones. Apparently. I was all ready to fight those mother- I mean, I probably would have lost the fight in general, but he threw a fucking rock at me. Sir Chen says, hey Rich, this is a drawing. Do you want to be a robot or a character from Ghibli? Studio Ghibli films. A Ghibli, I guess. Sure, why not? Yeah, you want to be a Ghibli. It's all fine. That lady just saw a crazy man with a, a mask and a knife and a gun and didn't say anything. Ooh. Definitely want to hide from him. Where's that other dickhead? Ooh, get up there. Kind of right in the spotlight now. This is not a good place. I'm not in a good place, Rich. I don't feel like I'm in a good place and I'm not comfortable where I am right now. Do you not have blink or dark vision powers? No, no, we have no magic powers yet. I have the power to... You get them, like, sucked out of you at the beginning of the game? Is yes. That... Uh, I have the... Oh, yes! Look! You can chop off people's arms and then throw it at other people. <laughs> this is my favorite thing to do. So you, <laughs> so you can, you can, like, distract a guard by throwing an arm of a different guard. Watch this. Ready? Oh, oh. <laughs> that was a great distraction check. There. Well, he looked at me. He was supposed to look where I threw the arm. Anyway, you can you can throw people's arms. And I kind of love that. I'm going to take his arm. How do I get out of here now? I guess I just walk. I don't know that shit. But maybe the cat. Oh, shit. Fuck. God darn it. That's fine, Jack. That's f everything's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. It's just a game. It is. I know. I've gotten past this point in playing this game by myself. Is all I'm saying. It's always best to play games you're, like, really familiar with on stream. I know. Not I know. Game, not a game you just started playing. I was feeling... You know what? I was it always makes you look bad, Jack. I was feeling a little confident. I'll be honest with you. How do we, how do we do this smartly? Where is everybody? That was one of the first upgrades I got. There's like a a, a vision where you can tell where people are. Where's actually. your goal? Where do you need to get? Maybe the Up there? No, there's a there's a ship over here. Yeah, but there's a thing above your head. That will oh. take you to the ship. Well, no, this is just the docks. See, it's there. Ah. Where is the ship? Nope. Oh. oh, good. Yeah, run away. Actually, that makes it way easier on me. Thank you. Oh, can you hit escape? He comes back with oh. help. Because there's one thing I forgot about. Yeah. Uh -huh. Key binding wise. Yeah. Is my health potions. Health elixir. You are going to be white. Great. Oh, sorry. That was my fault. What happened? I hit escape again. Maybe Jack should have started on easy. Maybe. That time was Rich's fault, though. 
Really? Really? You're gonna blame... You're gonna blame me because I hit escape while you were well, falling down well, after you had already died. Like, like after I died, you hit escape, and that I knew you were gonna hit escape, and so it really messed me up. <laughs> right? I mean, I'll I'll take a lot of abuse, but no, I know. Here, damn, here. Jack, damn. Here's the thing: I have this arm. Go investigate the arm! <laughs> Go investigate the arm! I see the arm! <laughs> Jack, you're killing it! You're, I, you're killing it! I'm like stuck in this place where they keep seeing me. <laughs> I threw an arm. Why do they look at me? Because when somebody throws an arm, are you looking at where that the severed arm landed or where it came from? They're supposed you're to say, what threw that fucking severed arm? Yeah, I'm We should go kill it. I'm gonna go. Th I'm gonna throw it like here. What did it? What? <laughs> yeah, like. <laughs> and I'm just gonna wait. Maybe they'll like disperse. I gotta. I gotta move in at least. Ooh! 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 What is that? All right, we got to figure out how to get, how to get out. I've, I've, I've gotten myself into a bit of a, I've painted myself into a corner, Rich. Jack needs to learn how Do to. Do they know where you are now? No. All right. Put but the, put if the, I, put the arm down and let's survey the situation. What's behind you? Guards. There's guards over there. There's guards over there and there's guards on the other side. Of and it. I can't get over the wall over that way. So I need to go this are way. Are you sure? I'm fair. I'm 90% sure. Like yeah. That balcony there. Can you get maybe up to that I, balcony? Maybe I could, uh... Yeah. No. I can get... Oh, oh, you know what? Hold on. Maybe I can... Get... There. All right, now you gotta get up on that ledge. There we go, okay. Climb up on that, that cable thing. Can you get up there? There's electricity on that. There's electricity all through it? Yeah, see? Uh, you get electrocuted. All right. Well, don't go down there. Turn to your right. Like there was a balcony over there. Like, is there a way to like? Yeah. Oh, oh there you go. Oh. And you know what? We'll we'll even be a little stealth about this. Okay. We'll put him in the dumpster. Totally stealth supreme. Okay. Oh, I must have gotten here a different way the, before. I've been here before. Okay. I know where to go from here. Okay. I didn't, uh, I don't know how I got to that other place. I don't even know how I got here. It's like a little hidden room. But by the way, that was just boarded up. And there was no tutorial for, like, you can break windows and shit. Yeah. I just found that and I was like, how neat. You can just break boards and shit. It's great. <laughs> Like this? Doesn't that look like you sh you can't yeah. go there in video yeah. game? Fuck that! Just break the board. Nice, nice. Who are you talking to? Oh, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Now, I've already played this level before, so I know there's a guy, like, right here. Yeah. And he's about to walk over here. And I'm going to jump on him and stick a sword in his head. <laughs> I'm going to let you know that. There he is. JP versus the world, I think, regarding the board, says, I think you should have had to have pressed A or X repeatedly for it to be a good game mechanic. What? Like a little icon that pops up. Tear oh. board down. Tear board down, <laughs> right. <laughs> That's what other games would do. <laughs> There'd be a little button prompt that says, you can break this board. Use this to your tactical advantage. Not decided to. They just put boards up and that's an option. That's an option. Okay. There's a lot of dead bodies too, also. 
They're fine. Oh yeah, that's fine. You let them be bodies. Yep. They're fine. Agreed. I'm, I, let me ask. I actually forgot how. The gameplay looks pretty decent. Says Scorn one to ten. Uh huh. Is the story any good? Because that's what matters. That's totally what matters. I hate. I hate what gaming has become. Can't stop it, Rich. Oh, wait. oh, I remember what I did. There's a lot of ways to handle this situation. There are uh, piranhas in the water, by the way. Oh, cool. So you can't be in the water for too long. Rich, what's wrong with people wanting a decent story with the gameplay? There's nothing wrong with it, but it it shouldn't trump really, really good gameplay. Like, this looks really fun, but is the story any good? Isn't a question you should ask. <laughs> it shouldn't be... You, the priorities shouldn't be that way. Good story is, is like... It's like icing mm -hmm. on the cake. It's not the cake. Agreed. Agreed. Again, everyone, keep in mind I've already played this before. There's two guys on the other side of this thing. And so I'm waiting for this guy to walk away so he doesn't see me kill those two guys. Because I kill everyone. I murder everyone. That's my MO. I never said it was wrong to want both, but if you're going to dismiss something because it doesn't have, like, uh, lots of story-based stuff, I don't know. That's that's what I'm that's what I'm speaking out against. Want to hear what I've got to say. Boom. I guarantee it. But I want my Tetris pieces to have an individual character arc, Rich. It's been an unusual day. There's a coup on your way, and I'm being blamed for the crown killer murders. My name's Megan Foster. Seriously, I dismiss games that don't have story. Doom is inferior shit to me. I mean if that's if that's where you're coming from, man, that's where you're coming from. We disagree. Is all we can say. Is all we can say. I, I enjoyed the Doom the Doom arc, the Doom story, as much as it was. Mm. But of course I'm not a story guy, so like that was perfect for me. Oh. Yep, I'm ready. That was perfect for me. No, Doom Doom actually had very good characterization. It really did. Mm -hmm. I think so. Okie dokie. Jack, go back and grab that severed arm. She could use it. Oh, terrible. Terrible. And I guess if you're playing like an RPG, yeah, then it matters quite a bit. Mm -hmm. Something's not right, but it seems familiar somehow. Who this cold? Where are you? You might as well show yourself. Corvo, old friend. Do I even have to say it? 
Who this dude? I gave you my mark for a reason. I wanted to know what happens when you take an honorable man's life away. When you push his face down in the mud. What will you do? Give him a chance. And what a sight it was. You gave yourself over to blood and terror. Gave it everything you had. Then you spent 15 years making sure it wouldn't happen again. Because why not? <clears throat> Bloody space whale, man. Bloody space whale. Oh. You can uh, choose no powers mode if you want. Or you can accept the outsider's mark. I mean, I want to use the magic and shit. Hmm. Uh, hmm. They might just be, you know, hmm. making an HD Thief remake. <laughs> hmm. Interesting. So then you get like swoopy teleport powers. Well, nope. <laughs> wow. I was off the mark. Oh, you know his his swoopy teleport powers are different than hers. She has like a line yeah. that leads to it. Like his is just the mark where you go. So I, I, I got a little confused there. Yeah, there. there. It's definitely his daughter. Because he just said daughter. By the by. What? I don't know that they... Exp like I said, I didn't play the full of the first game. But at least the parts I played, that was not explicitly stated. Okay. It seemed obvious he had a thing for the mother. Right. But she was a queen and he was just a bodyguard. Right. Just saying... This is where they're going in this one. There you are, my love. I know you. Do you remember? It's been so long. And you've been through so much. Even as an echo of myself. She used him for his strong semen. Yeah, you know, maybe. If all I can hear are the last echoes of your voice, that's enough. Only the last of my essence with you for a while. Look, I'm, I'm not against having a good story in games. You're completely... No, maybe you've never heard us talk about story in games ever before. Rich is the one that... Pushes for story in games. Not really push. I mean, it depends. Push. It, it can only help. A good story can only help. Yeah. I'm saying if you're looking at this, this is, this is specifically what I started commenting on. Yeah. If you're looking at this and you're saying, oh, this looks really fun. Uh huh. And then you follow that statement up with, but what's the story like? Then you're missing the point of gaming. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. You know, maybe the maybe the lack of a good story, you know, kind of hurts. And it could have been better if it had a good story that I cared about. Mm -hmm. But if like your judgment is predicated upon the story, I think that's weird. This looks really <laughs> fun, but Mechanics were smooth, shooting enemies felt great, had a wonderful level design, right. felt challenged throughout the whole thing, but just, you know, not a good story. So, you know, I gave the I give the game a total of an F for fail. See also Hotline Miami games being much more deeper and more fun explorations of the same themes as Undertale. Fritch likes story and not JRPG. He might like Red Dead Redemption. I love Red Dead Redemption. 
Yeah, yeah, you've said that. I've played it. We haven't streamed it, but I, I've played it and a lot. Mm -hmm. I like it. What? Yeah, that was that was a big story cutscene, but that gave us our superpowers. Now we have now we have super spooky powers, and uh, gave it that gave us a lot of a lot of story on the spooky powers. The Duke of Prune says, "I will repeat my argument, hoping." It'll get noticed. Okay. Games are a medium. They are supposed to mediate content. What does that mean, mediate content? It'd be a delivery system for content? Okay. Mediate? Okay. Uh, the the in-between between the... Con I guess? I don't know. That I'm scrolling up trying to find it. we got too many people in our chat, which is a good thing. A game that... A game that has only gameplay but no story is form without content. No. It may still be fun, but then it's a fun, gamey game and not art. Okay, why does your game have to be art? Why is why is that necessary? If you have art and a game, that's great. Yeah. But why does it need to be art? Games must be taken seriously as art. Because that makes me feel good about myself, my hobby. I don't have to feel bad about liking games because I can say games are art. My my card to point is there's you know art is not necessary. Agreed. Uh Oh, I can do it. Great. Uh No, that's not what I want. Uh, can you press J for me? Thank you. Thank you. You know what? You know what Mass Effect 3's problem was? Mm. Somebody decided it needed to be art. And somebody knew nothing about art and thought art meant uh, some kind of dark, bizarre ending that was tonally jarring compared to the rest of the series. That's what happened to Mass Effect. Mm. But it was art. It was art, absolutely. Story won't help a shit game, but it helps a good one. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, a good story can elevate a mediocre game. The whole thing that started this argument, though, somebody was looking at something that they thought was a good game, a fun looking game. And then the next question was, well, I'm not interested if, you know, how I read that was, eh, not really interested unless it has a good story. Mm -hmm. But it looks like a fun game. Yeah. A good story would be great, but if this looks fun. Rich, I still think you're reading too much into that question. Possibly. Possibly. Oh, sure. I'm seeing text. I'm not saying I'm not hearing like the tone of voice or any of that. I'm just reading text. Have either of you ever been compelled to finish a game you didn't particularly enjoy playing because you were engrossed in the story? Arguably Mass Effect. Though I would there's two ways of looking at that. The shooting aspects of Mass Effect 1 are garbage. Absolute garbage. Oh. 
but I'd argue the story in that largely was the game. So <laughs> that's what kept me going. Mass Effect isn't about shooting at things. Mass Effect is all about that dialogue wheel. Mm -hmm. The patented dialogue wheel. Patented, apparently, yes. Is what we learned. Ooh, hello. Ooh, hello. Batman Arkham Knight? Yeah! Yeah! Watered-down Batman Arkham game, but still pretty good story. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's another good example. <coughs> Yoink. Mass Effect 1, you could mod the guns like crazy to remove. There were also 8,000 guns, and it was a pain in the ass. And You're looking at a list of like 50 guns to see which one had slightly better stats. Yeah, no, oh, it was awful. Oh, the numbers game. I it's hate fucking num awful. I hate math, the gun game. To Dax says, just read that Trump's chief strategist, Steve Bannon, was a Seinfeld producer. Yep. Do you think Trump will draft the original cast to finally air the Twin Towers episode? Hashtag make Seinfeld great again. That, that's going to be his first executive order. <laughs> Wouldn't be the worst. Like, would they have a say in the matter? No, no. Yeah. Under under penalty of uh, imprisonment. They have to uh, produce, uh, uh, you know, the, he'll produce it, but they have to perform the uh, the Seinfeld 9-11 episode. I'm not, uh, you know, uh, that, that, that brings up some issues of, you know, freedom of speech and whatnot, but I kind of want to see the episode. <laughs> so I'm a little torn. I'm skipping this. Like a sword. Mass Effect 2 and 3 had terribly boring guns. I get that the multiplayer in 3 was popular, but I just never saw it. One had, like, the same gun, but just slightly different stats incrementally throughout the game. And in, in, in 2, 3 less so, fuck 3. 2, they felt different. The guns all felt different. Yeah, the fucking Revenant. That's good. Rats. Following Megan. Following Megan. She's gonna take me to the skiff. Doop a doop a doo. Hey, I found it. Anything cool over here? Nope. Let's rock and roll. Let's do it, Megan. Ready for me to drop you at the docks. Ready. The old city must have changed a lot. What happened to her arm? It's off. Nothing else matters. Maybe she lost it in the war. She's an old fighter. Maybe she's a pirate. Maybe she lost it in the Rat Plague. There's a thing called the Rat Plague. That sounds awesome. Yeah. I don't, know, I don't know. She's got a big, like, old scar on her face, and one of her eyes is, like, sewn shut. She's seen some shit. That's all that matters. Who cares how she lost it? She seen some shit. <coughs> Game Child UK says, Apparently Trump will be in the White House part-time. Desiring to remain living and working out of his penthouse on the 58th floor of Trump Tower. Right. While anti-Trump, as a New Yorker, I'd do it too. New York City is better than D.C. He can't, actually. Hmm? He cannot. They, they've already, uh, the Secret Service and the, uh, the mayor of New York has already forbade him from living at Trump Tower. He wants to. He wants to keep living where he lives. And, they, and uh, for security issues... They would literally have to close down four blocks in New York. What grounds do they have to forbade him? Uh, he can't shut down the city. The mayor can say you can't live here. 
He would shut down four blocks. Is there precedence for this? Probably not, but I guess I'm I'm guessing it, it would come up real fast. Okay. But the, yeah, they they've already said like no, you cannot you cannot live here for security reasons. The White House. That's why the White House is there. It's so awesome that Trump didn't think of that. I don't think he expected to win. No, no, he did not expect to win. He's still dealing with that. You, if everyone saw the pictures of him with Obama that first meeting, deer in fucking headlights. <sighs> I guess I'm doing this now. <laughs> I've seen that look. I've seen. I've done that look before. I, yeah, absolutely. I can do the. Uh, yeah. It's one of the main reasons he is not going to do four years. Here's the thing. At this point, with, with the way things stand now, yeah. you should not be rooting for Trump to stand down. Because while Trump is a boob, he is not Mike Pence. Very true. Mike Pence Do you is want a, Mike Pence nobody to wants be president Pence of the United no. States? No, no He's one. He's like super religious, sense. right? Incredibly religious. Yeah. And un and unafraid to push that religion on other people through laws. Look at this thing. Look at that fucking thing. I kinda love this. Like this is just a whaling town and there's just like canals of blood. Canals of fish and blood. Nice. Talk to you. Blood flies aren't that hard to avoid. Careful. Just go slow and avoid the nests. Oh, all right. Well, thanks. Thanks for the thanks for the heads up. Where do I want to go again? Where's my thing? There it is. Yes. Yes, I am worried about that. Oh. The Wall of Light is a dangerous security system from the age of the Rat Plague. Those not attuned are burned to ashes upon passing through the Wall of Light. It's powerful as a windmill, but you're being filled with... It shuts on the windmill. Possess a rat and find a small passage. I am being hunted by half the people in the Empire. Hardman welcomes the fight if they find me. What? It's too late for that, Apollo. Guess what happens next? Oh. This is how we get rid of snitches. No, you can't. Anyone ask? We just ran. What? What? No, I'm not looking for a fight. Anonymous says, <clears throat> fellas, what? what, what? Long-time stream watcher. Question. Yeah. Is your chat doomed to be at another cesspool of crocodile brains and lion brains yelling about politics? Are you at all concerned it'll be this way forever? No, it won't be this way forever. Things are very heated right now. Mm-hmm. 
No, and you know, as as long as he keeps it, no no name calling. Oh. Yeah, you know, I think right now it's starting to get a little bit crazy. Yeah, the chat. Hey, chat, be cool. We can have you. We can civilly disagree with each other, or stop talking about it. That's the, those are our two options. Can I climb this? No. How about that dishonor too? Uh, you know, huh? I I am really. How liking about it. that? I so far I am super liking it. How about the cubbies? How, oh my God, Rich! <laughs> <laughs> Does anybody remember those cubbies? Shit. What? You dickhead. Shot me. You know what you get? You know what you get? Barry, let's see. Bye. Dickhead. I got dickheads here, Rich. I thought the whole reason I was wearing a mask is so people wouldn't see me. A, a skull mask? Mm -hmm, yeah. That's not going to stand out. I think I just ate an ear. Maybe a pear. Oh, oh, that's a bad guy. I thought he might be a good guy. Can you eat that one of those apples or something you picked up? Yeah. yeah I want to hear, hear that sound effect. The crunching? Yeah. Oh. oh. Uh, okay, yeah. Uh, and bye. So you should knock him out and then throw him over the balcony. Oh, that's a great idea. Let's do that. What the hell is going on in here? Uh, yeah, next one I'll do that. I love that. What the hell is going on in here? Oh. Outsider painting. Mine. <laughs> I'm gonna steal that shit. Yeah. yeah. Oh, 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 that's doing something. That's doing something. Jack has not played the first one, and for one, I haven't played the second one yet. Yeah. And uh, I haven't played the whole of the first one. I, I have now. My computer was shit at the time. I have now gotten farther in this one than I have in my initial playthrough. I'm liking it so far. But I, I and even though I'm playing it wrong. I'm, <laughs> No point is you can play it how you want. The, You're not playing it wrong, Jack. So so far, that's my biggest compliment to the game is they leave it open. You want to do stealth? You want to do action? You want to take uh, the balconies? You want to take the street? You get to choose how you want to enjoy your experience. I think I think the action kind of ruins a lot of the experience of the stealth. Mm -hmm. I could play it stealth. You don't you don't you don't have those tense moments like you had in Thief. Like oh, I hope I don't get spotted. I hope I don't. Now it's just oh, well, let me just stab him now. Yeah, but you could play stealth. Sure, but it doesn't. It's not gonna feel as tense. Hmm. Hmm. Is that someone? Well, let's see if I can find another piece of food to bite on. Ooh, hello. <laughs> Want to get killed by a rock? You bet they planned for that. Oh yeah. I can't even fucking believe I got killed by that rock. Are you liking this more or less than Deus Ex? Is the question. Uh, so far, more. More. It's uh, it's a little more focused than Deus Ex. That was my big problem with Deus Ex. Is uh, is th there was just too many things to do, and the world was tough to get a, a grasp on. Uh, so far, I feel I feel focused. Oh, that's right. I, I'm trying to get around the wall of light. Any benefit to being stealth-like? Well, I know the first one. I haven't, like I said, I even haven't finished it, but I've heard that there's a different ending for not killing so many people. And at the, I don't know what they do in this one. If it's the same thing, where there's a different ending or not, I have no idea. So far, at the end of each level, you get kind of points, and and yes, they make special note if you did it stealthily mm -hmm. and or murder-free. 
Because there's, there's another thing for uh, a pacifist run. And so I would assume, yes, that you get different endings. Pull out the heart to see how many runes there are in this level. Exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point. That's a lot of exclamation points. Ow! Dickies asked Jack to pull out the heart every once in a while to look for runes, etc. You're playing it wrong, Jack. No, I kind of just don't want to. You're playing it wrong. I know. I know. No, and you know, this is not my save, obviously. So, like, I haven't really been concerned about the runes yeah. or anything because I know I'm not going to continue this game later. Yeah. But okay, yes, I will. I will, and I'll show people because maybe they don't know how the game works. So you get, you get this. This is your like quick inventory, you know, like you can. Oh, oh, that's right. I have my crossbow. Uh, and you get your, you know, I get my blink. Oh, that's right. I have my blink. You know what? I, I haven't been really paying attention. So, okay, here's the heart. It's a strange artifact that beeps. And now it shows us where all the cool stuff is, and you can get runes and artifacts and shit. Do I have to keep it or now? Are they? Oh yeah, I have to keep it out. So it kind of shows you like where the, the secret stuff is. Is there a secret stuff over here? Hello. That was look at that. By the way, hmm. that was another little was thing where. Chat. What happened? That was a door. Yeah. And hmm. it didn't look like it could be open, and you went up to it, and there was no button prompt. Yeah. And you have to find a way out. Uh, there's like a gate of light over here that you have to get around. He just knocked on the door. How lovely. How lovely is this game? Who's whistling? Can I kill you? I mean, I'm going to kill you. But should I kill you? I can kill you. People in this uniform, they deserve to die. This person probably doesn't deserve to die. Now that Rich person spends 10 minutes talking about how Thief is so much better because you have to look for secrets and how much more satisfying it is to find them yourself. You know what? I have never said that about secrets. Yeah? Yeah. Hmm. Morning. Oh, blood fly. What a blood flies. A wrench. I want a wrench. I want a wrench. And, and Thief, how does the rope arrow support Garrett's weight? Magic. The Magic. Oh, yeah, I know the answer to that. Magic. Well, I'm going to kill that guy. That's for sure. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Shit. <coughs> yeah? No, no. Okay. Anonymous says, fellas, previous Fel donator here. I hear you. It's heated now, but Xmas is right around the corner. Rich, what's your favorite Xmas memory? Jack, any word on the hot must-have toy for the kids this year? The hot must-have toy for kids this year. Uh, no, I don't really know. I don't really know. I don't, I, I, we, you know, we don't watch commercials or anything. We don't, like, watch TV with the kids, only Netflix and stuff. So I don't know what the hot new toy is. It's, it's always Legos. Like, that's all my kids care about is Legos and shit. So, uh... I don't know what other kids are, are into. Oh, uh, there's there's a big thing with Monster High dolls. Okay. If uh, if you got if you got a, a, a lady kid, 
also known as girls. Oh, I thought you you didn't treat your children that way. I thought when you went to the McDonald's, you didn't ask for, you didn't answer if it was the girl or the boy toy. You just wanted I such and such a toy. Yeah. But now I'm, now all of a sudden you flip flop Jack. Really, no, and now I'm it's not, now uh, and I'm, and I'm super, Monster High is a girl's toy. Uh, yeah, mostly because they're dolls. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if I've ever told that story on stream before, but there was one particular instance. <laughs> Where we went to the McDonald's Happy Meal, uh, I got I got some Happy Meals for my kids, and they were and they said uh, they had either they had either uh, Packers figures or My Little oh no not My Little Pony uh, uh, a stuffed bear it was a stuffed yeah. teddy bear or a Packers thing, mm -hmm. and the person at the checkout was like, "Do you want a girl's boy or, or a boy's toy?" And I was like, "What are the toys?" And they go, "It's a it's a Packers." Uh, it's a it's a pa a little Green Bay Packers figure or a stuffed bear. I'm like, hey, what do you what do you assholes want? Stuffed bear, Packers figure, and you know we don't watch sports, and so they're like stuffed bear, and I was like, oh, stuffed bear, and so she's like, so two girls' toys, mm. right? And mm -hmm. and you know my boys are right there, and they're like, what is that a girls' toy? And it's like it's a fucking stuffed bear, and and, and so yeah, I got into a, a bit of a thing, but yeah, yeah, but uh. So yeah, that like that was just a thing, and so it's just like no, like are you saying are you saying girls aren't into Packers? Are you saying boys don't like stuffed teddy bears? Fuck you. But that way, just wanted to, she, no. That she like, had yeah. a button that said "girls' toy" she, on the screen. Jack. Exactly. She's she's paid minimum wage. She yep. can she can barely afford her fucking rent. Yep. And now and now she's she's got she's got you giving her shit. Yeah, I'm I was giving her shit. How about you just say what the toys are and not worry about like girls toy, boys toy. Ow. Yeah, they asked me for a Christmas story. Oh. I, 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 I was gonna do it. I can't I can't remember how the story goes. I can't retell it well enough uh -huh. to do it justice. I was gonna tell the 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 Phoebe Cates gremlin story with the father in the chimney, but I'd probably fuck that up. You ever see Gremlins? Yeah, but I'm not remembering. The, the famous this. scene where she talks about the year her father died, trying to go down the chimney dressed like Santa Claus. Nobody could find the body until they, they you know, they like smell started coming from the fireplace. That, I, I that don't weird, remember that. that weird ass story in the middle of Gremlins. I, I don't remember that. No. Oh, hell. oh. Oh, gotta get in there somehow. So that's a ruin. No memes. Something heartfelt, Rich. I like getting toys. There's, there's your answer. It was really cool the year my father upgraded the my PC enough that I could run Doom. <laughs> that was great. That guy's peeing. Let him pee. I'm, I'm letting him pee. What? Shit! Out of here. Bye! Shit! Fuck. An Xmas P story? Jack is so good at video games. Yeah. I think there was one Christmas morning where I had one of those like just 10 minute long peas when I first got up. It just would not end. And there's not much more to the story. Just, you peed a lot. I just yeah. God, I, I just, it's Christmas. I want to go out there and open my toys, and I just, I, I keep peeing. God, this is this is infuriating. Did you go in the toilet? Yeah, I went in the toilet. Oh, good. Where, where, where would I like like my bed? Like no, where? Just, yeah, I don't you know. My a ten minute long pee in my bed. That'd be that'd be awkward. Yeah, I would. That'd be awkward. I mean, congr congratulations, by the way. Just kept coming. Forget it for going just... in the toilet.
Sari Chen says, okay, here's an Xmas question. Uh, Do you remember any, uh, what the fuck gifts you've gotten? Mine was some Costco pack of training bras I opened in front of everybody. <clears throat> oh, um... I do remember going to a Christmas party when I was a kid. I was a little kid mm -hmm. that was large. It was basically my, I never called him my stepfather, but that's what he was. Mm -hmm. my, my stepdad's family. I did not get one present from those bastards. When I was a kid. Nothing. Terrible. Oh, yeah. So I guess I guess my answer to that question is nothing. Now my my my, my siblings mm -hmm. who were born from that 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 stepdad, yeah. well they got presents. They got plenty of presents. I could go fuck myself. Oh. Oh, it's fine. I didn't like any of those pricks anyway. Uh. It was more than made up for on actual Christmas by my mother's side of the family. <clears throat> Fucking stop throwing rocks at me! Murder all of you people. Damn it. Damn it. How old was I? I don't know. Younger than 10. King Melos. Stop watching. If it frustrates you to watch me play this, I recommend you stop watching. What do I think of the movie A Christmas Story? I discovered it before TNT did. Uh, I was quite fond of it. All right. As an adult, I watched uh, It's a Wonderful Life, and I realized it's it's a fantastic film. Yeah? Yeah. I kind of love It's a Wonderful Life. Yeah, it's all right. No, it's great. What are some great Christmas movies? Uh, Scrooge is the most underrated one. Most underrated or best and everyone knows it? I don't know that everyone knows it. You don't hear much talk about Scrooge? Scrooge, yeah. Everyone knows Scrooge. Bill Murray. Look, I love it. I just don't know that it's universally acknowledged as an all-time great. Oh. I don't know that it is. Yoink. Bye. Carol Kane fucking makes Scrooge. Carol Kane is just in general great. And I don't I don't know why she wasn't in more things. Too good for that. She's hanging out doing Carol Kane shit. Like, like she makes the unbreakable Kimmy Schmidt. Every scene she's in, she steals. Yep. Hundred percent. I'm going to say Gremlins is a better Christmas film than Die Hard. If you want that not Christmassy Christmas film thing. Gremlins. 
Ah, uh, sure. Son of a bitch. Ah! I just don't get it. I don't get what I'm supposed to do. Die repeatedly. Well, yeah. You can try stealth. I, you know, I don't understand it, Rich. Okay. I don't understand what I'm supposed to be looking for or where I'm supposed to be going. Stealth in general. That's why I gravitate towards action. Stealth requires thinking, which in general is not my strong suit. JJ Cheeker says, Just letting you hack frauds know I really enjoy these streams and your content. Even when I have a shitty weekend, you hacks make me forget all about it. Thanks! Yay. And LOL, bing ma ding. Thank you! Thank you, JJ Cheeker. What was the Schwarzenegger Christmas film? Jingle All the Way. With uh, with Anakin. With Anakin Skywalker. Jake uh, Jake Lloyd. One of, and one of the last Phil Hartman movies. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ow. Yeah. One of the last Phil Hartman movies as, as, you know, random cocky neighbor. I thought For a second I thought you said... Bukaki neighbor. As the Bukaki neighbor, yep. <laughs> Which would have been entirely that's a, different. That's a very different kind of neighbor. <clears throat> hmm. Hmm. Buzzkill Jack. Eh, whatever. People die. That's a Mike line, Rich. We we have very similar sense of senses of humor, me and Mike. Mm. The the darker the humor, the better. Oh, oh, nothing up here. I think that's that's why we're friends. Uh, why you gravitated towards each other? Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. <clears throat> Muppet Christmas Carol is the best Christmas movie. Uh, Muppet's Christmas Carol came out that era when... Whenever you saw the Muppets, you just couldn't help but be reminded about Jim Henson being dead, and it uh, was depressing. Eh, still, it's it's a very <clears throat> it's a very good uh, version of Christmas Carol. Okay. But how can you watch it and not think, "Yep, Kermit's not Kermit because Jim Henson's dead"? Yeah, people die. People die, it's fine. Get over wow, it. Wow, this feels really hollow and empty without Jim Henson. Ah, it's got Michael Caine and it's great. <clears throat> it's fine. Scrooge is your is your off the wall Christmas Carol. Uh and and a Muppet Christmas Carol is your family friendly version, and that's all the versions that you ever need. Okay. The Christmas toy? Is that when Jim Henson did a Toy Story before Toy Story did it? Uh, I think I remember that one. Christmas toy? Yeah. He basically did the same plot as Toy Story, where the toys come to life oh. when no one's around. Oh. <clears throat> I 
element seven three one says Jack. Yeah. I'm gonna be real for a sec. Be it. Girl. Yeah. Don't listen to these haters in chat. You do you, boo boo. Let them haters fall by the wayside. You heard. Uh huh. Lol. Jack, my Packard. Great. I'm with you. Okay, Jack is with you. You should know. Blink, Jack, for the love of God. What? They want you to blink. Nope. No, he just wants to stab people in the neck. Blink could help him stab people in the neck. He could, like, teleport right behind them. Oh, fuck! I always, you know, I'm forgetting I have that ability. Is what's happening. Where'd that lady Jack go? Jack can't remember that he can blink. Where'd that lady go? There was a lady over here. I want to... The no magic powers intrigues me, though. Like, is there a different ending for that? I don't know. Does Jack have any what the fuck Xmas stories? He didn't answer, so I assume he just doesn't. Some people don't. Uh, yeah, not really. Uh. You killed that nice lady. Mm hmm She killed me before. So. So I'm going to say she deserves it. You know... What? You don't seem to have any loyal supporters. This coup seems to have gone on without a hitch. Doesn't that say a lot about uh, the queen here? I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't know what you're talking about. Apparently, nobody wanted this girl in power. I, I, I don't understand. I don't understand what you're saying. All right, all right. I don't understand what you're saying. She was, the, she's the queen, and and I was her protector, and I did a really great job of protecting her. Uh, you can tell I did a really great job of protecting her because now she's a marble statue. Which is like the second queen that I've done a really shitty job of protecting. Oh. Who saw me? Does that mean someone saw me? The heart could tell you if she deserved it or not. Well, that's weird. What? <sighs> the heart can tell you if she deserved it or not. Yoink. Stand up. Bitch. Ooh, coins. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to throw you against the wall. I can't go through that. That seems like a terrible hiding yeah, spot. Yeah, it's not a good hiding spot. I just wanted to get out of their direct line of sight. Shit. You're going to get killed by the person who was obviously right behind him that he was talking to. Well, I just wanted to kill one of them. You, 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 there. you kill the one in back... So that if you kill the one in front, the guy behind is just gonna see. You kill yeah. the one in back, and then you, you it's okay then you both. kill the other one. Took care of both. Not even a big deal. It's about taking what, what are you doing? What are you doing? Took care of both. Easy peasy. Look, they're dead. Isn't that all that matters? They're dead.
No rewire tool available. Oh. Oh. Alright, so what do you get for playing without magic? Is there a different ending for that? Or is it just personal challenge? Jack, do you have unspent runes? You might be able to have dark vision right now. I'm assuming dark vision is detective vision, but I'm not sure about that. Uh, yeah, I think it's like detective vision. Uh, I, I don't worry about it generally because... Um, Rich doesn't even like the game and he's triggered by how bad Jack is. Now I hate the game. Wow. I don't know where the fuck they got that from. I heard that about you. The heart can tell me if someone deserves to die. Well, if it's just achievements, that's stupid. Oh, okay. He's developed a taste for what? Uh, fine foods. So instead of uh, buying... Oh, look at that! Karen is in the chat, and she is subscribed with Twitch Prime. What? Thanks, Karen. Rinchard! Thank you for subscribing. I especially look, appreciate it. Look, Rich, I can make him suck his own dick. Oh, that's pleasant. Uh, he could have afforded medicine to save someone, but he ate cherry pies instead, so I killed him. Do 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 do. Let's see about I'm, this I'm guy. glad the first thing she heard after subscribing was you talking about a man sucking his own dick after you cut him in half. Mm hmm. She knows what she's subscribing to. Oh, he's, uh, he's going to die. I I think this is pronounced Jaime Hymeen. Jaime Hymeen says, Jack? Yep. What is that Wiimote-like device in your hand? Also, how's it going? The game or the device? Uh, your is, hand, that thing. So this is a frag... Shut up to the camera. This this is a, uh, a frag chuck. It's basically just a, a, an analog stick with some buttons and a D-pad and some more buttons over here. And uh, it's a more comfortable way to play games like this where, you know, like... It, it would be comfortable if those buttons in front that are normally the shoulder buttons and yeah. the controller weren't the most uncomfortable things in the world to reach. They're, it's poorly... It's not ergonomically designed. It is not ergonomically designed, so it's not a perfect solution, but it's uh, especially for, like, couch gaming and, you know, I have uh, the mouse on the lap desk here. And so this is... It's just an easy analog stick. Coins, great. Rich's mum thinks he's happened. Oh, thinks he's handsome. Oh, that's that's nice. Hey, Rich, look. Yeah. Oh, I've never I've never thrown a severed head in a game before. Look, it's fun. Sure it is. Throw a severed head. Got a head. Throw it out the window. Look, Chad. Jack has no interest in seeing if he has runes to spend on powers. He just doesn't care. Nope. Here and here's why. As I've, as I've discussed before, uh, I am not planning, uh, this is not my save on, on this computer right here. And so I, what I'm, what's going to happen is I'm going to go home and I'm going to continue my save playing as Emily. Let's see if I can hit the light. Let's see if I can hit the light. Ready? <coughs> nope. Oh, fuck yeah. That's great. That's a you great feeling. You should be doing this when they're just unconscious. You could be having a lot of fun. Oh, you're right. Well, it would just kill them. Yeah, but in a more fun way. How about I throw a body at someone? I'm gonna throw legs at someone. Hardcore. You want to be able to push both directions at the same time? You can't with that. When the fuck do you ever hit right and left at the same time and expect to actually do something? I'm sorry, what? 
I, I could be wrong. I could be reading that wrong. I think somebody is complaining about your device. My, my little Chuck here. It's inferior to the keyboard because you can't press two directions at the same time as if that would do anything anyway if you were using a keyboard. Can You uh, you have the keyboard right next to you. Can you uh, press A and D at the same time? I just uh, go one of the directions. Okay, try it again. Oh, no, I go... I, I hit A and D and I, I go uh, uh, left. Okay, great. Solve that mystery. Let me, try, let me try forwards and backwards. Sure. I am not going both directions. I am only going backwards. Sure. But interestingly, it prioritizes backwards. That is way interesting. And so, and, and unlike the keyboard, like if I, a, a keyboard, like let's say you wanted to move diagonally. <laughs> yeah. You'd have to press two keys at the same time. But here, <laughs> I can just move diagonally really easy. <laughs> Right? Not that two keys for diagonal is super hard, but it's not necessarily an advantage. No, neither is. But but this is this is, no, this is just an efficient way to do this. Rich, you're getting trolled. I don't care if I'm getting trolled as long as it makes for entertainment. Uh, you guys should have realized this by now. If I think something is interesting to talk about or poke fun at, even if it's a troll, I will read it and talk about it. Mm-hmm. Rich, do you like golf? No, nobody likes golf. Golf. You're a fucking weirdo. Weirdos like golf. Weirdo who likes to be bored. What that? I guess playing golf would be considerably different than watching golf. I don't understand watching golf, though. No. Have you ever played golf? No. Okay. Well, mini golf. Which one? I like mini golf. That's fun. Okay. That's good. I have golfed. I have golfed a few times. Even I've even had a couple of good games. A good games of golf. Yes, yes, Karen. We played mini golf all the time and we love it. I got two holes in one last time we went. Yeah? Yeah, it was great. You are a newbie to PC competitive gaming if you think hitting both directions at once can't ever be an advantage. Is this is this competitive single player Dishonored too? I, I want to let you know uh, this was uh, this was a tryout, Rich. I was trying out for Shaq's competitive single player <laughs> Dishonored. Uh, Sh Shaquille O'Neal is putting together. <laughs> I, I didn't want to tell you because I didn't want to make you nervous. <laughs> but Shaquille O'Neal is putting together a competitive single-player Dishonored 2 team. And this was my audition tape. And I thought this would give me the edge. This thing that makes it more comfortable to play the game I'm playing. <laughs> Wait, you mean you were just playing for comfort? But, but a, Yeah, well, I was just playing for comfort. Well, you know, I thought if I was more comfortable, maybe it, like my moves would be a little faster. But no, this guy's got my, he's got my number. <laughs> He's got my number marked, Rich. Yeah, you can't hit left and right at the same time, which apparently just makes you go left. Right? Mopar STL, explain how, as as the lead gamer yes. that you are, yes, please. Uh, the Uber lead mlg pro gamer yep how does that help under what scenarios does that help yeah, please give a specific situation in which hitting both the left and right key at the same time helps is is as advantageous to us as as want to be want to be pro gamers Dead. DDR. All right, well, we're not playing DDR. We're playing Dishonored. If we were playing DDR, <laughs> we would probably be using some other device. Competitive, professional <laughs> competitive dance dance revolution, Rich. He's, he's got us there. Well, that's a different person. That was oh, a different person. Oh, okay, okay, you're Here's right. Here's what Mopar's saying. Okay. 
you want to ADAD strafe back and forth in an online shooter, the button you let off of you go the other way. Slightly quicker strafing back and forth. Slightly quicker left and right strafing? I guess. I guess? Sure. Sure. You know what? Fine. Yeah, I'll give it to you. I don't care. I guess I just don't care that much. Where do I, Where am I going again? Oh, the carriage. I've heard it's a thing in Counter-Strike, says uh, Cisco Briscoe. Oh, okay. Where you strafe out and then hold both directions to stop faster than just releasing because physics or something. Okay, great. Next time we try to get into highly competitive MLG Pro Cisco gaming, that's what we'll do. Then I can't use this, is what you're saying. But for right now, I think we're going to stick to what we're doing. Gee, sweet Jeebus Crisp. Jigglelag35 says, hence why I don't play competitive PC games. <laughs> Ton, be, uh, because of the massive amount of bullshit that people will say to you? Are you telling me you don't hit the left and right button at the same time? You know you can stop a fraction of a second earlier when strafing. Well, I've been I've been ADA deep strafing now for about three years, and I think it's really brought up my game. <laughs> uh, I was I was ranked four hundred and twenty seventh. Now now I'm three twenty three, so it's like I went up a couple of little <laughs> went up a couple ranks. Uh, Lloyd beats no. I did not pay seventy dollars for that nunchuck controller. This is actually this is so now it's called the frag chuck. Yeah. By split fish fish. This one is the Frag FX Shark 360 because I bought this for my Xbox 360. How many years ago was the Xbox 360? Yeah, 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 wow. Uh, right. Uh, this was a device that you could, it actually came with a mouse and you could plug this and a mouse into your Xbox 360. Mm -hmm. And it, it, it ended up not working out. I wasn't ready for mouse gaming yet, but you know, I just kept it around because I didn't throw stuff out. And now I use it like for I use it for Overwatch. I use it for a bunch of first-person shooters. So that's tr you know what, Len Flakasinski, you're absolutely right. Real games have kill streaks. All right, I'm done. You're done. I can't. I mean, I'm not good enough, Rich. Okay. I can't handle competitive. One player dishonored too. I'm never gonna make it onto Shaq's professional team. <laughs> let me let me catch up with the donation. Catch up with the donations. Sari Chen says, "Damn it! Now I'm drunk. Gay for Jack is contagious." Element seven three one says, "I love this stream so much. I'm telling you though, ignore the haters who wait. Did you slag off golf?" Unsubscribing. Hello, <laughs> <laughs> Dick, my birthday boy. Perfect. Yeah, yeah. Perfect. All right, let me get. Here, let me alt tab it. Alt tab it. Alt tab it. Where this one? This one. All right. This is the part of the stream where we thank all the people who have subscribed to us during the stream. Much like Dr. Eckrigger. Dr. Dr. E. E. Krieger. Dr. E. Krieger. Thank you. You wouldn't know that if you watched Archer. Nope. Jack. Don't. Half Matt, half cat. Oh shit, three months. Love you guys. Beermeister2089 for 13 months in a row. And Beermeister2089 says 13 months as a pseudo lurker. LOL, Rooster is a cock. Luke, 72W! Who's mama you dissing there, Packard? That was my tweet today. It was, uh, uh, my tweet today was, uh, we might play some Dishonored, or we're just going to be dissing your mama. God. We did a. The, the, I'm in. You know. Uh, oh, th uh, this is what happens when you li leave me alone with the Twitter, Rich. <laughs> Don't do that. Don't do that. Too late. It's too late. It's already done. Zach is whack. Baba Yaga Lala. Baba Yaga Lala says, 
Did you unconsciously say this name during the Halloween Best of the Worst? Oh, maybe I did. Maybe that's where Baba Yaga... We were talking about... Yeah, we're talking about Baba Yaga. Baba did Yaga. Did you throw a lala on the end? I might have thrown a lala at the end. I was very that? intoxicated. And, yeah. and, <laughs> and Baba Yaga Lala is right in there. Uh, uh, encephalophatic. And encephal- encephalopathetic. Oh, encephalopathetic. Pathetic says two months of Amazon paying you for me. Thank you, Encephalo Pathetic. Mario Mario 42 29 fucking months in a row. Holy crap. Get on the trolley. That is all. We're on it. We're on it, Mario Mario. Rogue Null. Welcome. No wa at all. <laughs> I have reason to live. Mm-hmm. A reason. There's an A in there. Kick I, Girl V. Oh my god, oh my god, we scrolled way Where the top. Okay. Future Future J. Morgan's Bane. Gay for Jack. Dark Matter. 16 months in a row. And Dark Matter says D. Adeline. Biffopotamus for 29 fucking months in a row. Captain Muller! One small ball says, Tomorrow is the first day of the rest of your life, so grab it by the pussy. Maiden Waltup! That's how you do that. Trump bots, grab them by the pussy. Quinsomniac! Clone 2727 says, don't listen to them, Rich. Final Fantasy doesn't interest me either. <laughs> Medelvan. Medavellan. Medavelvan. Medavelvan says, love you guys. Prereq is my favorite Google blind Scotty. Okay. All right. Tadax, 22 fucking months in a row. Zeronic. Says, forget, had to do it manually. Forgot. Nope. Chernobyl Kinsman, 19 months in a row, says, it's all in the reflexes. Great movie. Great reference. (laughs) Thank you. Reculissa. El Contador de Sombra. Nice. Nice. Fraudip and Fraudip says, "I'll help you out." It's pronounced <laughs> Frodetp. I mean, Frody TB. Frody TB. Oh, is that it? Yeah. Frody TB. You gotta like throw some capitals in there or something. Give us a hint. Fraudip. Frody TB. Ah, right, that's not, I, that makes way more sense. The AD two hundred nine. Whoa. Sloshed from DuckTales for 25 fucking months in a row. White Vein. Ness Collecta. Evil Kumquat. Says, don't take this the wrong way, but the Russian baby song kicks the ass of Our Love is in Love. No. It might have you there. I don't, I don't, t- there. I don't take that the wrong way because you're absolutely correct. <laughs> absolutely. No. <laughs> Absolutely. This is the Russian baby song. The baby's died. The baby's That was improv burned. too, right? Yeah, that was all improv. Laura Story. The great and wonderful Laura Story. Where were we? Evil Kung Fu. Ba- Bozooka. Mm, isn't it? Oh, no. That's, a, that's Like Bo. Yeah. Bozooka. This new subscriber says, LOL, read my tweets. <laughs> Hensifrosh for 14 months in a row. I don't know what to write. Evil Lord David. Clem Fandango. Freewheeling Pope. Fresno. Oh, I know. Fresno Bob. Slugnut says something again. Thanks, Amazon. Also, shout outs to The Rock for taking our master again, Jack Corvo. Shouts out to the rock! Shouts out to the rock for taking out Master Assassin. Oh, taking out Master Assassin, 
Jack Corvo. Yeah, sometimes it's ju it's just as simple as throwing a rock at someone and they die. Oh, when, oh! When I died, when the guy threw the rock, I at was me. thinking wrestling's the rock. Oh, do you smell what MC Lucas is cooking for twenty nine fucking months in a row? Almost thirty fucking months. Oh shit! She by a river. Twenty four fucking months in a row says love you guys anxious about the new job tomorrow been watching your episodes all week while well, i've had the stomach flu mm -hmm. game on you goobers <laughs> good luck tomorrow yes good luck the off switch games that are games are art super mario brothers <laughs> is art 100 percent lake con 16 months in a row says good job guy good job guys keep up the good work rinchard hap 78 13 months in a row the duke of prunes cameron mitchell's ghost shut that fucking door forever hey, for oh aj pimps all oh. the this girl named Colleen also likes your stream. And at the last minute, snake lots of fives. Thank you for subscribing. We really appreciate it. It's true. We really 